Leon so makes it's a, a pig. It's not a pig. Yeah, he makes a pig. pig. You don't see it's a pig. It looks like a pig. Faradeen has raised on the button with sixes. He's certainly getting called here by Hansen with King Two of Hearts. You can see Gus play all types of hands. This is what made Gus famous back in the day, 15 year odd years ago. You've seen him winning WPTs with seven threes, seven fours. And this guy doesn't fold, but he does on this occasion is nine ten off. He has reloaded, so Probably going to put on the handbrake a little bit. And we've seen Hansen three bet actually, and I was wondering about that. And that's why that's why the 9 10 of Jean Claude has folded. And Hansen three betting with King two, and he hits the top pair. And again, we see the aggressor being rewarded. And he's Underrepresenting his hand with a king. Ah, oh, that's a really bad card. Could have ended the pot here, Gus, with a bet, continuation bet in the flop. But decided to play it a bit tricky. And Faradine has spiked a set on the turn. And he's certainly going to get paid at least once here. Because Hansen has checked the board, the king high. It was checked by Faradine. So Hansen is not going to put Faradine on a king. He's probably hoping, he's doing a bit of Hollywood in here. He's probably hoping that uh, Faradine is something like nines or tens because he raised the button and called the re-raise. That's what's going on in his mind. And that's what Hansen does. He's, he's, he's decided to re-raise. This is great news for the Bulgarian. How much are you playing behind? 5,200 and I'm pretty and sure if Faradine moves all in which he probably will because he don't mess around too much this guy there's a spade draw out there there's a straight draw out there there's actually a made straight with the 4-5 that's the only thing that's beaten Faradine but he got re-raised no, by Gus Three flop, so anyway, it's, it's probably anyway. disregarding <laughs> whatever happens. No, we can't get over the 25. I don't know. Faradine is going plus through the options in his mind. He has position, so you a call here is a good move. Don't see anything wrong with a raise either, but just call. This something. is a good move because giving Hansen another, another chance to <laughs> bet it out. And another Eight. good card here he for Faradine. And Gus was drawing dead, really, when he raised. He's swelled the pot to 15,000. Gus is only 8,000 behind, so it's going in. The money is going in. There's no doubt in my mind. Uh, Gus may just check call, may bet it out, but he's never check bet folding here. He has seven or eight grand already in. He's only seven or eight grand behind. He could have that. That would be great. I don't know why Faradine is taking his time here because Gus only has a couple of grand behind, so. Ah, this have to call is, 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 is like, I mean, he should, should, he should have. Oh, la, 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 la. He lost, he lost a few thousand there, Faradine. I guess it was a bad check on the flop. And Gus correctly makes a comment it was a bad check in the flop. Again? Stop, it's stop. Money's coming in, coming one by one. Jean-Claude is down about 42,000 so far. Pierre is down about 20,000. And Gus is down approximately 20,000 today. And we see a Queen-6 Jack rainbow flop. Um, Leon has hit the jack and he bets it out. 
believe he's going to get called here by Hansen with top pair. Actually, Hansen has two pair. He's hit that very strong. And he's just flat called, disguising the strength of his hand. And Newville with backdoor diamonds and a good shot. Looking for Leon to make two pair, and that's what happens. Leon makes two pair, and Hansen is two pair, but look at Pierre Nouvel. He's hit the second nuts here, King nine. Leon smartly checks. He understands that that 10 has brought the straight, but Leon will be good. Leon's going nowhere. And it's a check by Gus. I think Gus thinks he's trapping here into the button, and Pierre oh, you. oh, is doing a bit of acting here. <laughs> he has the nuts. Pierre's playing about 18 grand. He is the short stack of the three players in the hand. Leon is the giant stack of 56,000, and Hansen is almost 40,000. And we're definitely going to see. This pot swell quite big, and that's a 3,700 bet. The yellows are thousands, the whites are hundreds. And Leon just flat calling now. This is where Gus might make a move. Man, I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. Never had this hand before. <laughs> Never ever. Never? Never ever. Gus, very talkative today. <laughs> have that. I don't know what he has. I don't know what he has. I just don't know anything. I just don't know anything. The best three in the world? He's not folding, I can guarantee you that. He's just going to call, I believe. The best from the west. There's a lot of hands beating him. And he just flat calls. And we're going to go to the river. Gus and Leon behind here. They're only 10% to win the hand. And the straight holds. Take it. And there's 20,000 in the pot. There's three cards to a straight out there. Queen Jack 10 giving Pierre the second nuts. But look at his opponent's hands. Leon with jacks and tens. And he's considering a bet. Leon is considering betting here. There's 20,000 already in the pot. Leon first act. And he has checked, sorry, he's checked it around. Gus has checked. And there's a massive bet, bet. Well, it's all in from Pierre. And I like it. I like this bet. He's moved all in, and he's certainly getting called in one spot. If Leon folds, I'm positive that Gus will call him. No, you did not. <laughs> and Gus oh, folds. Come on, I wanted to call. I knew I had you beat. Yeah, and uh, Gus one. reads it right. I don't think. But I'm he has to call. I don't Gus says, I, "I knew I had you beat," I'm but you have Jackson he's. What is it, 10,000? He's calling out uh, Leon's hand, and he pays him off, and Pierre scoops. And that's a, that's a monster pot, 50,000 euro pot. Sorry, 40,000 euro pot awarded to Pierre. And Ace King suited on the button. Just a flat call from Gus. Tomovich made the raise with 5 3 of spades. Gus in position on the button. Next, a flat call, and that's a great flop for Ace King. And Tomovich is going to lead out to represent the Ace. He does have a good shot. No spades on board. I'd love to just see a call here from Gus. He's under-repped his hand already, pre-flop. And this is a good play, just flat calling. And as long as a two doesn't come up. And that's a pretty solid card for Gus. It is a heart, he has slight concerns about the heart. 
So if Tomovic bets here, which he probably will, because he's not putting Gus on the hand he has, he's putting Gus on King Jack, King Ten of some sort, and he's representing the ace. He's the pre-flop raiser, and he's now he's bet 17. He's in pretty bad shape, Tomovic, because he really doesn't understand the strength of Gus's hand. And this is just another smooth call by Gus. Again, under repping his hand in a big way, and it's giving Tomovic the opportunity to fire again. And Gus has played this extremely well. The pot, pot is built up to 7,000. We're going to see a three or four grand bet here, I'm sure. Because Tomovic is not putting Gus on Ace King. Right. Here we go. It's just going to be a flat call because it's a straight and a flush there. Gus with top two. Crazy See by Gus is a monster stack of 100,000. But he. Um, he is down. He's down quite a lot so far. He's down about 35 grand, I believe. He's always calling here. There's no way Gus is folding here. He's just Hollywooding. Because when he calls, he doesn't want to see a straight or flush. But, and Tomovic sees the bad news. Picked up a really strong starting hand here with Jackson. Decide to disguise the strength of it by just flat calling. He's called everything. Jean Claude is calling with King Nine off. And now we're up to Cabrel, who has 10 Nine of Spades, or 10 Nine of Diamonds. And if he enters the pot, he normally would re raise. And he's just no, called this, this occasion. Hand. 9-10 suited, does flop very strong, and it's called again, and I'm pretty sure the Gus was looking for a re-raise there. But we're five way now, Gus with the over pair to the flop, but look what tune is after flopping. Set of fours, and Tomovic. Best flop I've ever, ever seen. Tuna have checked so. into Gus. Now, every single time we've seen Gus bet out on the flop. And it's the same story here, but it does have a legitimate hand this time. The problem is that our new player in seat one, Tuna, has flopped the set, which is absolutely monstrous in Hold'em. And it's strong enough okay. just to flat Being call. The best and okay. a disaster here would be a jack for Tuna. But a five, which will may slow things down because Worst it brings, I've ever seen. I'm gonna it brings a four card straight. And Tuna checks and but the river Hansen checks. On the other hand. And it brings hearts oh, and a straight, but there's no way Tuna's folding here. And Gus is considering a value bet with Jax, and he's trying to think straight. He has consumed a fair bit of alcohol. I won't kid you. And it has gone check by Tuna, bet by Hansen. And the bet is 3,300. Gus is saying it's a crazy bet, but it's not really a crazy bet. He's value betting here. He actually thinks he's ahead because. Tuna has you checked lot, the first I'm act. It's her uh, fault. It's her fault. He believes if he had the straight or the flush that he would have bet it out. He's never putting him on a set here. And Tuna's obviously calls. And if one big pair says goes, it's not good enough. And Tuna shows the set of force to scoop a sizable pot. Very bad bet on my part. By like Fahadi in 2000. Uh, you know, uh, He's just room. called yeah. and look at Gus Hansen. Yeah. With pocket nines, he is just called. If you, if you call like, and all right. 
is Jean Claude with Jack Tree of Clubs. Of course, he's going to call. This is Sidney Down and Jean Claude. This is the man for King. 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 So we're looking at five in the way. And the ace king of Tomovich versus three other pairs. And Jean Claude is in this hand also. But it's not showing it on the graphics. Jean Claude with a suited jack, I believe, of clubs. I'm gonna bet. Uh, I said I was gonna get a huge flag. And six two uh, two. And I will. The say nines of Hansen is gonna bet out. This is what Gus has done every single time. He's bet out the flops. He is gonna get called by Faraday because Gus is playing extremely loose. He may even get called by Pierre, who has pocket fives. Is it 3,000 bet? Oh, no, not the no, and Pierre gets out of the way. And this is going to be interesting. Now, the hand is still on. This is not really a smart thing to do, give your hand away, because he's after betting. And Fahadeen is called with tens. I know I have the, the best king hand, has but missed. If the jack of diamonds comes, I'm could be in trouble. Jack of diamonds. I don't want to see jack of diamonds. You agree? No jack of diamonds. Oh my god. That on the other hand I wanted to see. Uh, and Gus probably believes he's ahead here. He may put Fahadeen on 66 maybe a club the draw. Number of the devil I can't do that. 72. Or sorry, a diamond draw. Two diamonds on the flop. And it's a big sizable bet here. Looks like 7,200, and that's what it is. And this is a pressure bet now. And oh my God, he's still calling. Tells, he is ahead, and he's still calling. So it's going to be really interesting to see what happens on the river. There's 25,000 in the pot, and ah, oh bingo! My God, I cannot believe that. That is an insane river, and just insane. Gus is. Uh, Basically, and the good news it wasn't the Jack of Diamonds. I was, I was so scared of the Jack of Diamonds, Queen of Diamonds, scared of that one too. But now I have to bet. I will bet. Gus telling Fahadeen what he has, but trying to make out that. See, this is where this is where I'm weak. He would know much better. He's trying to steal the pot. He's going to put in a big bet. Gonna bet. I'm going to bet. It's going to be nine or ten thousand at least, I think. The number that's not allowed in the U.S. thirteen. It's thirteen thousand. And Farhadeen has made the right decision all the way through this hand, calling with the best hand, the pocket the tens. Floor, the floor, the floor, but but now he is gone behind. Hansen has spiked a nine on the river. And this is a huge pot, guys. First, what do you say, Pierre? You didn't big pot in quite a while. You just didn't expect it, right? But I think Faradine may read Gus because Gus is giving away a lot of information. He's talking away. He's he's a, I will not see your car, a good amount of alcohol on board. <laughs> in this position, <laughs> I don't want to see your car, please. That could be one of the, the game over, factors that. Faradin considers. He knows that Gus is a little bit drunk, and that may be one of the reasons that he can call here. Now Faradin was a big winner so far, but he's a lot of money already invested in this pot. Yeah, no, no. I'm respecting you and respecting my friend, and I don't want to finish you close to be in my position for the rest of your life. I don't want to be in this position. I prefer to look. Not sure what the hell is going on in the background there. They're having some conversation about something completely different. But this is a huge bet, 13,000 that Farhadeen is facing. And the longer it goes on, I feel the better for Farhadeen because he's gonna he's gonna try and see through what's going on, and that's what he's doing. That's a fantastic fold. <laughs> That's why I didn't believe that. That's I, a fantastic I, I, fold. No, no, no. I just, I say I don't want to be in this position yet. Of, you know what I mean. And 
he's played that so well. He's called every time he was ahead. And Ghost got extremely lucky there in the river. And Leon, 5-3 off. And you'll see the action from the middle of the table. And Fadine has picked up the aces again. And he very well may get a call from... You got exactly 18,000. Queen Jack of Spades. It's a pretty big raise. He had a bad experience with aces earlier. But he's done the right thing here because he's thinned the field down to heads up. Is what you want when you've got aces. Butler Academy. And calling. Would you believe no Phil is going to. Yeah. Voila. He's going to chase his flush draw. He knows his ace is no good. He's suited. Ace two suited. And Leon is considering a call here. There's already 14,000 in the pot. And it's just too bad. You will not drop money for nothing. And Faradine now with the aces in a 14,000 euro pot. And Queen High flop here is going to be a nightmare for Gus. Oh, that's a good flop. Nice, nice. Jack Queen of Spades has picked up a flush draw. What's, what's going on here? Is the aces of Chet. Just in case he counted wrong and he only has. I'm probably going to see a bet here, a flush draw. And then you're going to see uh, Farhadine. I don't think Farhadine has given up on these aces. He's going to move all in. And you're certainly going to see a call by Gus. will be priced in for his flush draw. And here we go. All in. And you're going to see a call. Snap call. It has to be a call. He trapped me. Uh, he trapped me, but he has out. No, He's a backdoor no, straight. You want two times? Two times, if you want. Two times? He wants two times, we take two times? You don't need two times. I have to see, it's impossible. I have four cards to hit spades, it's impossible, no spades. Okay, that's No black. good for Gus. Not the right black. It's still black. Another black. No. And no good yeah, for Gus. No. Okay, one time. <laughs> They've decided to run it twice which means the existing pot will be split into two pots uh, and the first one out which Fahadine has won uh, and now the second run out and look he can still hit a spade Gus spade is a little, <laughs> Gus a little bit drunk that's why you see him messing with the chips in the board he needs a spade and uh, doesn't come there is always a hope nice hand sir Fahadine no 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 one, 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 one. Scooped a monster pot.